Hello and welcome to this video in Nykick Binder Express. This is your library of binders where you can store existing binders and save new binders. We can open a binder by double clicking it. When you open the binder you can see the table of contents and the tabs within which you can add and organise your own documents. To add a document simply click on the tab, right click select Add Documents, My Computer, and choose the document that you would like inserted. And there it is. You will also see that in the table of contents, this has now been updated to reflect the fact that a new document has been added. OK. Let's start again from the library to create a binder, but this time from a folder. So again, we choose File, New From, and this time we're going to go for the Folder option. We can now browse out to our computer or any other network share we have available and choose the folder. Now this folder can ha also have subfolders, each including different documents. So I'm going to choose my binder content folder here and click OK. Now, Nykek Binder Express will take a look at the folder structure and the documents within it. It will then import these documents into the binder and replicate that folder structure with the corresponding documents underneath them. So again, here we see the blue covered binder. When we open up the binder, you can see that we have the table of contents. It is populated with the folder names, the subfolder names, and the document names. As we go through the binder, we can either click on the document and can continue to click to access subsequent documents. We can click on tabs and we can click on subtabs. We can also navigate using this bar across the bottom. I hope you have seen how easy it is to navigate through the binder, as well as to create the binder in the first instance. Thank you very much for taking the time out to view this video. We hope to see you at nykickbinder.com, where you can download and create your own binder for free.